Lindsay, and today I thought it'd be fun to remind you guys of all the free accessories that you can get here in Royal High because there are a lot of new players here in Royal High now, and, and now that it is a new year, I feel like this would be a good reminder for older players as well. So first, let's go ahead and get the free items that you can get here in Campus 3. So the first one I can't get because I don't know the code, but if you come over here to the fireplace and you click on the bricks, there will be bricks that stick out. So if you know your four digit code, you can go ahead and put it in and you can enter through here and get a paper airplane. Now this item was out since Campus 3 came out. So some of you guys may already have this item, but if you are like me and you still don't know your code, well, here is where the secret code door moved to. So you can continue to attempt to get it, or you can be like me and just wait for the future phase that is supposed to have the secret code. So for this next item, you will need the light fairy power to get it. And we are going to go outside to front of castle. So I am going to go through this door. So once you make it outside, you're going to look towards your left and you are going to fly up. And you're going to come to this tower right here. You will see a big glowing yellow or gold rock, whatever color this looks like to you. And you're going to use your light powers on it. And you should make the rock disappear. It might take a while. And now the rock is gone. And the free item is the picture perfect face light item. However, I do think this item might only work for you if your device can handle high graphics. I don't think it works with low graphics. There is a chance this item may not work for your device. And next, we are going to the school office. So this next item is in the head mistress's office. And there are two ways you can enter the head mistress office so the first way is you can have the quest that says the headmistress will see you now and then you can enter I don't think I have that quest but let's see so no I don't have that quest and the next way is you can break in through the vents that are in the dormitory bathing quarters but you will need other players to help you break in and I am going to show you how to get this item but I will be doing a voiceover because it is a mini obby and it really doesn't matter how big the obby is is big or small i can't do obbies while i'm talking so i am going to do a voiceover explaining how to get it once you enter the head mistress's office you're going to head towards the desk where the painting is because in her hand in the painting there is a key that you'll need to click on so we're going to click on the key if i can't angle it right and now we need to get across so we do need to jump Fair warning, if you fall in the lava, it will teleport you to the front office. And we made it across. So here's a diamond chest, but also there's a false wall. And if you go through the false wall, there will be earrings, the headmistress's earrings. And now we are going to go to the dormitory bathing quarters. So now we will be entering the vent maze. So if you didn't know how to get there, now you will. So what you need to do is go to the laundry area, which is over here. And now you're going to come over here to this dryer. You're going to open it and you can see there's no bottom. So now what you need to do is go into the dryer and drop down. So now that you're in the dryer vent, we are going to go straight. And then once you get to this point, we are going to go left. Now we're going to go right and we're going to go left again and now we are going to go straight. So I'm going to put my walk speed on run because we're just going to go straight for a while. So you're going to go past these two turns. You can go past these two turns as well. And once you get to this turn right here where you can only go right, you're going to look to your left and you're going to walk through this false wall. 
and there will be a chest there is one thing about this free item and that is it goes in your backpack instead of your inventory so next we are going to go to diamond beach there are a lot of free accessories you can get on diamond beach so the first item we are going to get is the swimming flippers and in order to get the swimming flippers you need to come over here to the lifeguard so we're going to talk to the lifeguard and start the lifeguards quest so to do this quest you need to find 75 pieces of trash so you'll find the trash laying around the beach areas so right here is one and another thing you want to do is fly over to those islands there will be trash over there as well and that quest will give you the swimmer flippers so next we're going to come over here to the stage and there will be an npc on the piano and we're going to talk to them so for this quest we need to find a 40 music notes and the music notes will look like this so you're going to want to look for music notes and they'll have a blue glow around them now it is easier to find them with the blue glow when it is nighttime and this quest will give you the antique messenger statue which i feel like is a very cute bag and it is a must-have for campus three next we are going to enter ocean's nursery and ocean will be a frog so you need to find 10 of these things for ocean orbs i forget what they're called and i did not read the dialogue i kind of forgot to read the dialogue to find out what the things are called but i will show you what they look like around the map so here is one so they are multiple colors and they glow so if you're having a hard time finding them there in the daytime wait for nighttime and the item you got from that quest is the froggy bucket hat now we're gonna go next door to the pizza palace and we need to talk to zed so now we need to deliver pizzas we are delivering 30 pizzas in total and right here you will see the address so what you do is you can grab a scooter, but if you have a hard time controlling them, then you can just run. And now we need to go to the neighborhood. So you're gonna go up this tunnel right here. And then when you exit the tunnel, you'll be in the little neighborhood area. So now you're gonna look at the address and find the house number on the mailbox. And that quest will give you the oversized summer shirt. So the last quest in Diamond Beach is the lighthouse quest. So to start this quest, what you will do is go up to the lighthouse and knock. And you will see the lighthouse door knock prompt and you'll do that and this quest will give you the heart of the ocean necklace okay so now we are going to go to the beach house there are two free accessories at the beach house so the first chest we are going to get is an important chest you do need this chest to be able to complete the darling valentina set because this item does go with the Valentina set. And we need to go up these stairs right here. And there are two sets of stairs that we need to go up. So it is going to be a long walk. So now that we made it up here, we are going to go towards these doors right here. And when you go through them, you should enter a pirate room. And now we are going to go up these stairs and there will be a chest location. And they'll have the darling Valentina playful puppy ears. And now we are going to leave this area and we are going to fly this way and we're going to fly until we reach the edge of this red house right here there used to be houses going all the way down but now they don't load so once you are here you're going to face the water and i'm gonna go in first person for this and we are going to fly towards the water so once you are in the water you are going to fly and you're going to look at every rock because the chest is by rocks and i can see it right here and we are getting the fluttering butterfly sleeves item so if you have the fluttering butterfly set you do need the sleeves to complete it next we are going to sunset island sunset island has three chests 
But since I'm only showing you free accessories, I'm only going to show you the two chests that have free accessories. The first accessory is really easy. You will see the chest right when the boat comes to Sunset Island. So you probably already opened it. So now we are going to go towards the green screen. So I am going to run over there because I'm sure you know where the green screen is by now. It is over here. So right here is the green screen. So once you're at the green screen, what you're going to do is walk over here to this point in the sand. And it is right here by this rock arch i think is what this would be called so you're gonna go into the water so what i find easiest is to go under this little rock arch right here and now we're going to go left and there will be a chest right here now this chest can be pretty tricky to find but in it you will find a tropical hair flower and now we are going to go to the trading hub. So if you did not know, the trading hub does have a free item you can get. So once you are in the trading hub, you need to go towards the elevators. So once it lets us in, we are going to walk over here towards the elevators. And we need to go to floor one. And it can be hard to click on floor one, but I found if I kind of stand in the corner, I'm able to click on it if I go in first person. There we go, it worked. I don't know why those buttons are so tricky to press. So once you are on floor one, you are going to walk towards these doors right here. And I think the code is 777. So let's go ahead and submit. And that is the code. So now you're going to enter and there will be a chest right here. It is Ice's UFO item. And of course, don't forget to do the wheel. Your daily wheel spin might give you a free accessory. You can get free accessories from the wheel. And of course, try your hand at the fountain. Halos are accessories and if you win one, it is free. So if you get lucky and you win a halo you just got a free accessory so those are some free accessories that you can still get here in a royal high i'm pretty sure i covered them all but if i miss one please let me know down in the comment section down below and also i'd greatly appreciate it if you could like subscribe and turn that bell notification so you never miss when i post and i will see you in the next video bye i need to go take a shower i am stinky